AI is out of control. People are talking about the dangers of AI, how it could become sentient and take over humanity. But I want to talk about a much more important issue, which is AI sex bots. So guys, maybe you saw my video recently where I found out in real time leaked AI nudes of myself online. There's a photo of me I found with my body, but they AI Photoshop created uh, an erect penis on me, which I have checked and I've confirmed, double checked with my modeling agent. It's not my penis. It is, it is, it is an AI enhanced thing they put on me and it's big. So I was very conflicted. I don't know if I should thank them or if I should be mad at them, you know, because it definitely made me look good online. But I was like, how fucked up is it that with AI, you can literally create anything. I've seen photos online of like Chris Hemsworth with his penis out. And I don't know if it's him or not. It's very hard to tell and it's gonna be harder and harder. To figure out what is real and what's not. So in this video, I'm gonna to react to AI bots that are supposed to flirt with you and send you explicit images. Bro, bro, bro. As a warning, this might be more explicit, but we're doing this for science, so let's go. Now, given there's all these AI nudes out there, I've never done an explicit search for this, but let me look at this real quick. Hot, naked, AI nudes of... Oh my god, I can't believe I'm doing this. I'm so sorry. Chris Hemsworth. I'm sorry, Chris, but I have... Last time it's already, you know, he's already fucking, you know. Oh my fucking god. This looks like Chris Hemsworth. This is pretty fucking nuts. There's him pregnant too, which is also a fantasy. Doing gay things with Tom Holland. Here we go. Oh my god. I just typed this shit in and somebody has already done it. Crazy. Oh my god. God, this is crazy. What the, oh my God, I'm on this website now. I hate this website, but let me see. This is Henry Cavill and Chris Evans. Look at the faces, bro. This is crazy. This is, this is not, ex I mean, what if I'm like, you know, making fun of AI and then it's like, oh no, they actually did that. This is real. Bro, this is so good. Like from a technical standpoint, look at the face, bro. Chris Evans, I mean, we know no, he, he would be the bottom. This is so fucking real and I'm shocked. I'm blown away by this. So guys, there's this platform here called Me For You, okay? And what they do is they basically uh, create AI avatars, AI enhanced photos of you, and they create a chatbot experience, including explicit images and videos of you. Um, they hit me up and I'm gonna have my own AI avatar on their site. So I'm gonna now check it out and see what the whole, what the jizz is about. So when you go on their website, you have a couple different creators. This guy here, Tommy Scala. Let me look this guy up real quick. Okay, here we go. Fitness model, so he does a bunch of stuff here. So this this is Tommy Scala. What is up, fam? So it's 2024, and one of the things I've really been focusing on is staying more active and challenging myself. Listen, I don't want to body shame him, but like this is him on Instagram, and this is my dude. But do you see what I mean? Looks a little bit better, yeah. Hey Mario, Tommy Scala here. I'm your go-to guy for all things wild and sexy on me for two. Ooh, that's so hot. What is your dirtiest, darkest fantasy. Curious about what fantasies you're craving to explore? Let me know and we'll make it wild. So it's actually his voice. Oh wow, that is crazy. And if you compare the two voices. It's staying more active and challenging myself. Glad that picture got you fired up. That's just a small taste. It's pretty close. It sounds like him. he's got a little bit of the vocal fry. Uh, you want to dive deep into the darkness, huh? Picture this, you tied up completely at my mercy and I whisper every dirty promise into your ear. God damn, this is pretty good. Tommy? I'm hot right now. Okay, it says here reveal image. Should we reveal the image? Let's reveal the image. Okay, so two exclusive photos a month. Subscribe. Let's fucking do it. I'm an investigative journalist. So this is $9, which is similar to like a lot of OnlyFans you would have. All right, now let's click on reveal image. You ready for this? That doesn't even look like the same person, dude. 20 times more ripped for sure. Look at the fingers. That's the one thing you can tell. Everything else looks so good with AI, but the fingers, yeah. It's kind of crazy, like the fantasy is better than the actual thing, you know what I mean? Like, I could not take a photo this great. The lighting is just perfect. The skin looks perfectly even, you know? If you were in that and you want that fantasy, do you care if it's real? That's the question. Like, do you even care if it's real or not? Very fascinating shit, man. So let's just go explicit. Let's just see what it is. Can you show me your penis? Sorry, this is for research once again, but why is he not talking? I like when he talks to me. Hope this gives you a little taste of the excitement. What are you talking about, my bro? This is worse. Okay, if you're really a fan of this guy, this is great. Like, I think there's a lot of potential. You can just talk to them. If you can ask, say, an inspirational speaker, ask him about life advice, and you get advice in their tone, I think it's quite valuable, you know? Penis. 
Anything specific you want to talk about. Okay, maybe this one is trained to not be super explicit. Let me check out some other ones. I think this is very interesting though. Hey bro, nice speedo. Where are you from? Where's this guy from? Either Russia or like Romania or something like that. Romania! What did I say? Did I say Romania? I have long to short term memory loss. And what turned you on about my speedo short? I didn't say I was turned on. Calm down, Dan. I'm not gay. So he switched it up so well. This is exactly what you tell a straight guy. It's like, I'm not gay. He's like, right, bro. What's your leg routine, bro? What about the Raiders? Are you gay, bro? <laughs> I love that he went straight gay again. I just said, hey, let's keep it more straight. He was like, what's your fitness routine? I asked him, are you gay, bro? He goes like, can you handle the intensity? You're in the corner. I blindfold you. Can you handle it, bro? <laughs> it's so funny. Okay, reveal image. Let's see. By the way, when this video comes out, you can check out my bot. I signed up for this platform and I'm going to have it create images out of images I fed it. So I'm very curious to see how mine are going to turn out. Oh, this is a weird AI photo. This looks like it was taken on a webcam. You sound like a dominant guy. Do you also, how can I say this in a nice way? I don't want to like scare him off and be too upfront because we just met even though it's a chatbot. I would still want to be friendly with him. Do you also um, take it in the butt? Okay, so, you know, I think it's nice. All right, bro, let's see. Let's see what you got, brother. 10 exclusive photos. Uh -huh. I have the promo code, I have the promo code. Oh, I didn't apply it, I didn't apply it. Oh no, I'm paying for it now. Bro, this is my business credit card. My accountant's gonna be like, hey, um, so there's one charge for uh, dominant fit man Dan sex spot. What is that charge for? It's like, yeah, it's a business expense. I mean, it really is. Okay, cool. All right, this doesn't look like AI. So this is basically a photo of like an underwear bold shot. Honestly, this platform is kind of cool. Like you can convince yourself that this is a real conversation. The voice is really fucking good and I'm actually curious to hear my own when it comes out you can check it on link below I'm gonna put it here when it's available I don't know when this video drops but I'm gonna put it down below because this is pretty intense do you prefer Jewish people or black people anything he says it's on him okay anything racist things he says now <laughs> that makes sense so it's fine he just doesn't want to admit he hates Jewish people that's cool damn man this is interesting let's try one more I'm very curious about this let's check out the Bruno Wolf I just want to check him out again on Instagram because the last guy looked so different, you know? Bruno Wolf. Yeah, very different content from his Instagram for sure. I can't find his socials or anything, but hey, Bruno looks fucking great. He's on roids or something. We can also talk to him in Argentinian. Hablamos de tu pinga, por favor. Let's talk about you. Pinga. It means penis. How many centimetros is your dick? What? Oh my god, what are you talking about? Mystery! Bro, bro, bro. <laughs> I just asked him about like quantum centimeters and he was like, oh no, let's keep some mystery alive. And then he sends me this photo out of nowhere. This is my guy. He's like, hey man, can we please keep a professional cockpit? <laughs> I wonder if this is AI because this looks so real. Very impressed by the voice. Very impressed. Also kind of concerned because dude, AI is so good and this is the worst it'll ever be this youtube video alone is probably enough to feed an ai model with my voice right so you can do this without my consent and make money if it you know what i'm saying like i don't know if you saw my last video where i saw my leaked nudes they basically did that they put my content behind the paywall without my consent used my likeness to make money and actually i had a lot of profile views people paid for it so they made a lot of money with me money that i'm actually entitled to i mean this platform is great because it's all consensual but like ai technology where do we go from this? It's over. I think porn is done. I truly think porn is done. Also, if you're a porn star, say you're a porn star and you're a porn star in terms of like you have a following. Why would you ever do something in real life? Like why would you ever take another photo if you can just generate it? But at the same time, it's like if, if, if you have these nudes, I have had some nude photo shoots, but I can just be like, never happened. Not me. This is AI. And we're gonna get to a point in a year where you cannot tell the difference. You won't be able to tell the difference. In a year, you can probably just go online and create a video of Tom Holland plowing Morgan Freeman. Because we all wanna see that. And it's gonna look real. Like, how can you tell the difference? And then what is real? And is, are we living in a simulation? Is anything real? Am I real? What am I? 
I didn't think this video was gonna trigger an existential crisis for me, but it sort of did. I wanna know your thoughts on this. Would you care if you watch, you know, adult films? Would you care if it's real? Do you care if it's real or do you wanna go to get into the fantasy? Uh, subscribe, guys. Click the link down below if you wanna see my AI avatar and chat with me. Let's have a little chatty chat, yeah? I love you, man. Stay crunchy, Carrot Kingdom, and I'll see you in the next video. It's not a real one. Yeah.